summer to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. Jim, how are you reading the formation? Yes, and the importance of this formation is not to allow the midfield three and the attacking three to become too detached from one another. If that happens, then pressure can quickly be applied via the counter-attack and you can be exposed defensively. So compactness can't be compromised. And you need talkers in this team. You need leaders and people that are willing to organise things very quickly. We have already started here. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Yeah, Paolo Dybala. His game's all about... Going for goal! Goal! Just so calm under pressure. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a needle the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of now you've got him, now you don't. Brilliant. Palmer have an early lead. Good start. Rabio. Hoists it forward. And here's Chavinho. Rabio battles to win it back. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Palmer are oh, very much in charge here, dominating possession and a goal to the good. Ah, oh, he's given it away. Oh, that's nice. Fired in. Take by the keeper, he's read that well. Chiesa. Oh, that's meat. Bentancur. Kortic gets it out to the wing. He's through. He's got away. Trevino, can he deliver? That is terrific skill. Could cross it here. Caramo! You can get that clear. Palmer scored early, of course, and it's 1 0. De Ligt. Brings the first half to a close. So there you have it, a close sport half of football, but that it still had its moments and ultimately produced just one goal. A decent game up to now. So, the views on the first half.
Yes, they're behind, but it's a, a reversible situation. As long as better defensive focus can, can avoid a second goal on the counter, they know they have the wherewithal to come up with what they need. Palmer come off having scored the only goal of the game so far. It's been tight, it's been exciting. There is certainly plenty for us to chew on. Massive lead! Oh, just needed a better contact. Now that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to uh, to pick out. It's played forward. Trust the field, it goes. Arthur. Forward it goes. And has put a stop to that. And it's Chavinho. And it's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Bentancur. Quadrado, beautifully done. Quadrado, fired deep towards the back post. Cleared away. Well, this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Well, hit and hope is just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Just has to be done. First touch and almost as good a second. Cristiano Ronaldo brilliantly took control of that, which was exactly what the situation required. Mitch Chavinho. Parma are clearly looking to kill this game off. It's keeping the ball away from the other end, too. A forward pass. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Bentancur. Juventus need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. Oh, he's not played the ball, that's a foul. The referee has resisted the temptation to go to his pocket, it's just a stern lecture. the most important thing, however it came. Final score, 1-0. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Well, to me, this is a result, Peter, that says an awful lot more than the scoreline suggests. You know, after the goal, the team just settled down and, and looked surprisingly comfortable and didn't really...